Hi, welcome to another amazing episode of our video series about some unique things present in this world. I still believe that the nature has its own way of instantly restoring your faith that you don't know a lot of things about this nature because every day it unveils a new mystery and makes you feel astonished because nature never ceases to amaze us. In this video we are going to discuss about 10 different animals which are quite unique with unique properties and some amazing characteristics. They are super duper hot animals and in addition to that we are going to make an addition in the very end that would be a bonus so watch this video until the very end of it. Number 10 Mangalista pig also known as a pig in sheep's clothing. Ladies and gentlemen, this pig actually belongs to Hungary and it was actually discovered in the mid 19th century. This animal is one of its kinds because its body looks like that it's a sheep but when you look closely it is actually a pig. It stays covered in fleas because these fleas are attracted to sheep and the coating of this pig is actually sheep like so that's why it remains covered throughout the year. Ladies and gentlemen, this animal was about to extinct in the 20th century because only 200 of the individuals were alive and that was because it was so much hunted that its population declined exponentially. And if you ask me why? Because of its tasty meat. The ham of this Mangalista pig is so delicious that the local community never gets enough of it. Number 9 Rhinopithecus This beautiful animal has golden hairs all over its body but its face tone resembles to a pale brownish river. It is also called as Golden Snub Monkey because its nose actually resembles to Suleiman Sultan of Ottoman Empire. It has golden body parts but its upper skin tone is actually black on several parts. So it is multi-colored monkey. Have you seen it? If yes, then mention it in the comment section. Number 8. Emperor Tamron Emperor-shaped Tamron's body actually resembles to a hawk. Its skin and its face is like the Willem Sultan II of Germany and his face and moustache is exactly like him. They live in a group of 4 to 6 individuals and give birth to twins always. If we talk about its food, it usually intakes nectar and fruit but it also eats frogs and birds. Number 7. Patagonian Mara If you think that it's a cross of kangaroo and a hare, think again. This is the seventh largest community of rodents in this whole world. Ladies and gentlemen, a Patagonian mara actually jumps up to 182 cm and they squirt like guinea pigs. The male Patagonian mara actually guard their babies and they have a flighty nature. What do you think about these beautiful organisms? Mention in the comment section. Number 6. Fluffy Cow Actually, it's not a new breed. It's a very ancient organism but it was discovered in the late 19th century. It takes a lot of months to grow their wool and their fur looks shiny when it is polished with certain chemicals. There's highly in demand in the market because the students and the young children actually like it a lot that it's a very good alternative of a pony. Number 5. Markhor Goat If you see an organism whose horns look like a receiver or an antenna that is actually receiving radio signals from the space, it's actually a Markhor. Its hoot body size is approximately 180 centimeters. Its horns can grow up to 5.2 feet. That's a very unusual characteristic because 1.6 meter long horns are actually taller in height than an average Chinese man, right? And why is it so? Because they fight in the mating season just to get a female, while the female can only grow its horns up till 10 inches. They eat flowers and fruit, etc. Number four. A raccoon dog. Raccoon or dog to domesticate. If you are thinking about it that which one will be more suitable for you, raccoon dog is something you are looking for. Why? Because you can get a raccoon as well as a dog both in the same packing. Raccoons are phylogenetically near to dogs and foxes. They are monogamous and they live their life with just one partner. They bring food and flowers for the pregnant lady but no one have ever seen them bringing up the flowers so I assume that maybe it's a wrong thing to mention here. They have a very short hibernation period and their voices are so cute. Number 3. Blue-footed booby. This blue-footed beautiful booby actually comes up from the Galapagos Island and it's a production of theirs. Charles Darwin was one of the first guys who have ever seen it. They do a tremendous job in flying as well as in swimming. They dance in a very weird fashion in the mating season. The males dance with their feet in a proper synchronization that it looks like a tap dance or something. Then this sky point 
They're raising their feathers and the female will join the dance and locks the deal. There is also an explanation that why they have blue feet. That is due to the fish diet they actually eat and it depicts a healthy immune system of theirs. Now, what's the color of your feet? Mention it in the comment section. Number 2. Malian Kologo Their eyes are so unique that it looks like they have seen everything from the past until the future. They look like a flying lemur but they are not. They are poor creatures, their whole body weight is between 2.5 to 4.5 pounds and they do not fly like a lemur. They do have a flying and gilding membrane that can help them in gliding and it can also glide between two or more trees. But they are so awkward climbers that you don't want to see them. Number 1. Venezuelan Poodle Moth It was first discovered in 2009. It looks like a furry poodle because its whole body is covered with fur. Mostly it's white in color and the only insect which is actually warm-blooded because normally the insects, they are cold-blooded animals but the fur doesn't actually heat up the whole body so the body is naturally warm-blooded. They are so cuddly and so cute to look at. Now is the time for an additional bonus. Cloud antelope. It lives in the cloud. Its diet is sun rays and candies. Now you are thinking that this is something new, but come on. This is actually a toy that was made by a company in Florida and we hope that someday we find an organism that looks just like a cloud antelope. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you have enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for the latest updates.